what I'm doing is making blue dots to hopefully rock the vote in our congressional, congressional district two here uh, to really help us uh, secure another blue dot for Nebraska. The blue dot's been a bit mysterious for some. Others know it right away. Others, they get there a little slower. But the blue dot represents the uniqueness, which I think is a privilege and an honor in Nebraska, in that our electoral college system is not a winner-takes-all approach. So this kind of is battling the, oh, the opinion that some would have of my vote doesn't matter if I vote or lean more blue because we're in a dominant red state and winner-takes-all. Like, no, 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 we're not winner-takes-all. Your one vote uh, could actually end up being one electoral college vote. And we've also seen reports that are very legitimate in their analysis showing that there, a virtual tie, a literal tie could happen with the electoral college, whereas Omaha's one blue dot could go uh, just that blue and could actually be a historical event changing the course of history as far as presidential elections. The response has been way beyond what we thought. It just started very much as a Oh, just a quick little thing to put in the yard, uh, very homemade, literally homemade, random, and then neighbor by neighbor on neighbor by neighbor on our block asked, where'd you get that sign? Oh, we'll make a sign, we ordered 10. And then all those friends that got their 10 on the block, they then contacted us again over and over saying, my entire carpool group wants one, or my running group does, or, you know, kids were wanting them, and then it just blew up, so now we're literally have now I've distributed several hundred in a course of just over a week. Uh, we'll be at a couple thousand, about 2,400 between being distributed already and being made to soon hopefully find homes. And then we're facing the reality of if that goes quickly as it has, hundreds a day, that we'll probably at least consider moving to having them more mass produced professionally. But right now we're loving the grassroots nature of it. Groups are getting together with their friends, they're making their own or helping them know how or they're representing by storing them at their house so people don't have to drive clear to Dundee if they'd like one in Saunders County or in Sarpy County or West Omaha, North Omaha, etc. It is 100% donation and if somebody doesn't want to donate we still want them to take a sign. Not everybody um, has $10 It's a recommended $10 donation of which gives us enough to create more signs and signs for maybe lower income areas that have reached out to us and so we are we offer them free there and then you know there's some people who um, aren't even in this area that have just sent in a donation but it's all donation right now and we're putting it to great use if we have anything left over afterwards we'll also donate that to um, the nebraska democratic great party and then the douglas county and the douglas, douglas county. county democrats will so, split the proceeds evenly among nobody's those two making money on this i just want to be clear about that no one's making <laughs> money you sure? thank you've been waiting patiently thank you